Hey guys, today I am going to the spot where Jim Corbett killed the last man at Asap Kumau. This is very bumpy and rugged road. Somehow I am going to that place. Uh, it's very difficult to move over here. This is Kot Kendri village where Jim Corbett stole and room. This village is deserted. Today also you can see how deep it is how it might have been 100 years back. The place where I'm going, nobody could discover that place, accepting content, sir. I'm the second person who went over there. This is my third tour, where I'm showing you the spot where Jim Corbett killed the man at Asap Kumau. I passed my night by reclining like this in open veranda, and finally next day, I went to talk. Champa district of India. Hola, BC Murari over here at Tak, between Tak and Kot Kendri, in search of caves and these big boulders where the great Jim Corbett came. I'm retracing the place wherever all he had gone. This is a huge boulder. I'm looking so tiny. It's so giant in size compared to this. I'm so tiny. Big boulder it is. Today I'm over here with my companion, my son Salu, Golu, this small boy Sonu, and of course my guy Lashman. This big cave, huge in size. Hey, Sonu. Sonu, what did you do? Yes. How are you feeling? Lashman? Yes. Here, there will be a lot of water here, right? Yes. 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 See, they are very much visible, and even this one, and this one, one never knows it may be inside. Mm -hmm. I'm afraid. Saru, come, find mm -hmm. your camera. Maybe there. It's a so. It's a dark inside, but we are taking risk. Here, my guy, that man, he's showing me. Uh, it's okay now, Saru. Right now, I'm very happy. Meeting this gentleman, Krishna Singh at Seam, who is just narrating me how the people are living over here, and especially this gentleman, he is a teacher by profession. Basically, he belongs to one village which is called Barkum. Which... Ah, please, आप अपना अपना परिचय दीजिएगा पहले. मेरा नाम कृष्ण सिंह कुमार हां बेसिकली आप टीचर हैं मैं मैं टीचर हूं साथ ही प्राथमिक विद्यालय में शिक्षा मित्र के रूप में जी बहुत अच्छी बात है अच्छा मुझे यह बताएं कि यह जो यहां विलेज हैं बहुत दूर-दूर से फैले हुए हैं और यहां अप्रोच जो है बहुत दूर है तो यहां के लोग कैसे सरवाइव करते हैं इनकी मार्केट कैसी है इतना इनको पैदल जाना पड़ता आज तो गाड़ी एक दो साल से मुझे लगता है कि यहां सत्यवान वगैरह आ जाती होगी अदरवाइज जो आपकी प्रेडिकामेंट्स है जो आपकी डिफिकल्टीज हैं मुझे लगता है आपकी मार्केट या तो चंपावत है या टनकपुर है तो आप इसको कैसे मैनेज करते हैं हम सर अब आजकल तो एक एक दो साल से तो ये गाड़ियां आ रही हैं हां और बरसात में बड़ी प्रॉब्लम होती है अच्छा बरसात में नाला आ जाता है हां तो ये लधिया है सर लधिया है लधिया है और उधर से भी पूर्णागिरी का रास्ता वो गिर जाता है पहाड़ गिरता है तो फिर ऐसे में आप लोग कैसे होते हैं पैदल जाते हैं पैदल जाते हैं पैदल यात्रा करते हैं वेल राइट नाउ आई एम एट गोइंग टू मीट गौरी सिंह जी who will help me in my endeavor to find out the exact place where the last man eater of Kumau was killed. Well, before going to that particular spot, I met Gauri Singh Ji, the only living person in this world who remembers witnessing that incident when Jim killed the last man eater of Kumau at Tark. मालदार जी का झाला था उधर तो वी है दुई सौ मीटर ये बट क्या है अच्छा 
तो वहाँ उन्होंने मार दिया भाई वो तो भी लास्ट में मेरे कहा नवम्बर और महीने छू नवम्बर दिसम्बर और महीने छू जैस मार्च में भी यहाँ खूब हलचल है गया हलचल अच्छा अच्छा उस शेर लायक तो आप ना देख ले जब लावे जुग भी लाए अच्छा खाल हाल वाई कर दिन छे वेलकम टू द स्पॉट वेर द ग्रेट जिम कॉर्वेट है This is very adjacent to Tak. Tak is just half kilometer from here. This is the very spot where he rested his elbow, keeping his handkerchief in left side and in right side. There was the gun, and the tigers was coming for, from that particular direction. The moment he looked or he saw the tigers, its eyes, he saw the first blood into her eyes. Then second blood was shot accidentally. That's what he had mentioned in his book. And third blood was shot when he was into the ear. And by the time he saw the third blood, the tigress sprung from the ear, and Jim fell down headlong along with the gun. And here was four people. Who could dare being into the huddle? In between, there was the goat. Thanks to those people, they saved Jim. As well as that gun. So, if it's third time in a row, I'm coming to this spot. I'm I'm very much thankful to Ramesh, boxer Ramesh, who has been kind enough to accompany me. And just now, my son Salu and Golu, they are also following. So I am retracing the backwater where the great team killed the tigress in 1938. and people come from far and wide but it's very difficult to reach this place because it is in the mid of the forest one can see how thick and dense forest it is right now imagine how it might have been almost 80 years back and that time this whole area was encompassed by trees and full of wild animals and the man it was of kumau was roaming around left and right strolling so finally he killed the tigress now this is historical place and here one board has been hung with the help of lakshman kuntan sir he has just made this in the name of the great jim corvet i am very thankful to almighty that i could come to this place i am really very happy thank you guys those who love environment who want to know more about wildlife please enjoy this video and see this is very very pertinent in the in the, in the sense that this was the last tigress he had killed after that he gave up killing and then he became a famous photographer of wild animals thank you Here we symbolic gesture. I wish for the success of this boxer Ramesh, who has played many national games in boxing. I really pray to God he should really represent India. May God bless him. He has been kind enough to assist me in each and every field. Finally, we are leaving this place. I wish and hope. Time and again, I keep on visiting. There is no road right now, but shortly road will be built. That's what I feel, and it was really tiresome journey, but very enjoyable. With my team, Ola, I'm winding up from here because I'm exhausted, haggard, not much energy is left. My tongue is parched. There is soot in the root. That's what I feel, and I I really. can't speak now i'm sorry thank you thank you guys enjoy it bas ho gaya bas ho gaya so to fort kendi attack you happen to meet these two guys who are just you know working on this road they are kind enough to tell us the way about fort kendi well finally we are reaching to the place called tak where jim carvet pass 
many restless nights and days before killing the manator of Kumau. Tak is far from Champa district. This was the very place where the man eater was roaming freely. Finally, Jim killed it. Thereafter, he gave up hunting and killing and became the famous wildlife photographer. Thank you.